It's going to take time, isn't it? Yeah. And, and you've got all the time in the world. At their new temporary home in the safety and freedom of Lincolnshire, 17-year-old Boris and his mum, Maria. It could also be Ukrainian or English. But it took them seven days to reach the safety of Johnny and Emma's house near Sleaford after leaving their own home and family members behind in the eastern Ukrainian city of Dnipro. One day is trying to, uh, from Dnipro to Lviv, from Lviv uh, to Poland. And from uh, him, uh, from these borders, we trying to uh, railway to Krakow, fly from uh, Krakow to uh, London. We finally met uh, our sponsor as uh, Jonathan. Yeah, very thanks to him. I, I'm so pleased. Uh, we are so pleased to him. We've had a few video chats, but um, the first thing they wanted to do was hug me. So, um, yeah. But we have another family of, uh, of six arriving. Uh, a grandmother, um, 62, a uh, 37-year-old mother with, um, with four children, three, five, 10 and 15. They're waiting for the visas to come through. Um, it really shouldn't be taking this long. Really, um, you know, they've been through enough. These people. <laughs> Maria's left her husband behind. Um, she's left her sister behind, who's got a partner. You know, that must be a constant worry every day that um, they're okay. Nobody should have to leave their homeland. People is fantastic. Polish people, English people, all oh. help us. Thank you.